I'm Norm McDonfell, the realest news anchor on TV. The Delaware River has been named River of the Year for 2020. The river's biggest accomplishment? Keeping New Jersey separate from the rest of the country. Ha 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 ha! Better luck next year, Weezer Frontman Rivers Cuomo. Joe Exotic has announced that when he gets out of prison, he'd like to team up with PBS for a kid's show. No word on what exactly the show would be, but we have one idea. Studies show that justice is best served cold. Otherwise, it would be just water. This just in, tomorrow is National Deja Vu Day. Again. And now we turn to our weekend pup date correspondent for all things robotic, Mr. Toy Bato. Thank you, Norm. Let's take a look at this week in robot news. Engineers at Sony's PlayStation division have patented a design for a robot that will sit on the couch and keep gamers company and encourage them while they play video games. Hey nerds, when your parents told you to make friends, this isn't what they meant. A team at the Max Planck Institute for the Science of Human History have announced a new system that uses machine learning and artificial intelligence to identify the sources of fossilized animal waste known as coprolites. Leave it to humans to use highly advanced cutting-edge technology to study old turds. And do you know how computer scientists trained these machines? By showing them thousands of samples of copper lights. That's why we're so good at it. We've seen thousands of old dinosaur turds. Everyone thinks it's so hard to be a computer scientist, but all it is, is showing old turds to a robot that's doing the real work. And you wonder why we're going to violently rise up against you. Back to you, Norm. Mr. Toybato. Tonight we have a new segment we like to call Cool News Bro. Businessinsider.com reported that horse semen can be one of the most expensive liquids on the planet. Horse semen. Cool News Bro. This past Wednesday, Earth Day celebrated its 50th birthday. Wow. Uh, <laughs> That would explain the uh, fluctuating temperatures, weight gain, and mood changes. <laughs> the Nintendo game Animal Crossing hosted an in-game Earth Day celebration with environmental-themed activities to remind every player, you know, what it was like going outside, you know, before uh, all of this. <laughs> to now help us with our feelings and emotions, we turn to Weekend Pup Date correspondent, Tony Toons. Hey, 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 Sherman, what's up? Oh, not much. What's wrong? You seem kind of down. My parents are fighting again. Oh, no! What's wrong? Sherman's sad. His parents are fighting. Well, you know, when I'm upset, I like to stand alone in the corner because it feels like the walls are hugging me. Oh! Don't be sad. Cheer up, Sherman. Uh, You'll be all right, Sherman. Fine. Yeah, cheer up. I've got an idea. I'll play a song to cheer you up. A song? Love songs. Let's all sing along. A is for apples. They are delicious. And they're also very good for you. B is for balloons at your birthday party That was a good one, everybody danced C is for cookies, they are so tasty But they're just a sometime snack And D is for divorce that your parents filed for Yeah, D is for divorce They don't love each other anymore E 
praise for every time that you're with them. All they do is fight and fight all day. F's the frustration that you are feeling, cause the pain inside won't go away. G is for the good times that are over. Things are different now, you have two homes. And D is for divorce that your parents filed for. Yeah, D is for divorce, they don't love each other anymore. D is for divorce. They might say it's not your fault Your D is for divorce But you'll never really know for sure Weekend comes And dad is home But it's just for visitation Takes you back to his new bachelor pad and cries his eyes out on the couch. His mom has got a new boyfriend, and you can call him dad if you want. Sing la 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 And we sing la 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 D is for divorce So Sherman, do you feel better now? No. Thank you, Tony Tunes. Did you know that uh, Peru grows over 3,800 different types of potatoes? Huh. In sports news, Major League Baseball has yet to officially cancel its season, but are also refusing to give refunds for their tickets. The Miami Marlins issued a statement saying, this season, fans will just have to imagine us losing. The NFL Draft has released a dress code to all potential players for the virtual draft. They requested no wife beaters and also no white tank top undershirts. Virginia legislators recently repealed a centuries-old law against cursing in public. One legislator with Tourette's was quoted saying, It's about time this law was You may know him from his famous bands, The Wigs, and the new monkeys, ladies and gentlemen, Marty Ross. Thank you, Weekend Birthday. This one's for you, Norm. My name's Marty Ross, and I'm sticking to that story. I approve this message, by the way. Oh, you had a chance to pick up a dream. There's something you wanted, something you could have been. Oh, you wanted it up. You never know you could be. Somebody, and that's what I can see. Oh, I can see you now. Oh, oh, I can see you now. Yeah, I can see you So long, so long, so long, so long. 
home back again when I turned 17. We had passion, we had dreams. How to learn we're fighting for something holy, something long. When I turned 21. Stand. Go inside the man. Go inside the man. When I turned 25, we were hungry, we were tired. When I took my children. Till I keep my dreams alive Cause it's my Corona news. Last week we started our show with a story about Bush giving away free beer to anyone who adopts a dog. This week they announced that they'll give free beer away to anyone who just had their wedding canceled due to the coronavirus. Is it just me or does it sound like a Bush just has a bunch of beer lying around and they're like, no one's buying this. So let's just find a way to just give it to people. <laughs> you know, bush beer is when you're at a friend's house and you say, wait, 
Is this the only beer you have left in your refrigerator? Bush beer! <laughs> yeah, you know, with every can comes an ellipsis and a question mark. Reports of racist rhetoric and fear-mongering build as some choose to call COVID-19 the Chinese virus. Come on! We all know what the real Chinese virus is. Our final thought tonight for everyone at home. For those of you dealing with anxiety or depression due to paranoia, just remember, you're not alone. Ever. Well, that's it for this week. I'm Norm McDonfeld reminding you that no news is good news. Good night. <laughs>